From officers leading with strategic brilliance, to dedicated soldiers, marines, sailors, and aviators on the front lines, each rank plays a crucial part in maintaining the strength and efficiency of the British Armed Forces. In this video, we'll take a look at the ranks in the British Armed Forces, in ascending order of seniority. The ranks of the British Armed Forces are divided into two groups, other ranks and commissioned officer ranks. Let's start with the other ranks. Members in the other ranks start as recruits during basic training. Following completion of basic training, recruits advance to the rank of private in the army. Depending on the corps or regiment, the title can be different. Soldiers may have titles such as guardsman, gunner, and trooper among others. In the Royal Marines, the rank is Marine. In the Royal Navy, the equivalent is able rate. In the Royal Air Force, there are three equivalent ranks. Air Specialist Class 2, Air Specialist Class 1, and Air Specialist Class 1 Technician. Next in order of seniority is the rank of Lance Corporal, in the British Army and Royal Marines. In the British Army Royal Artillery, the title is Lance Bombardier. There is no equivalent rank in the Royal Navy. In the Royal Air Force, the equivalent rank is also Lance Corporal, but the rank is only used in the Royal Air Force Regiment. Above Lance Corporal is the rank of Corporal in the British Army, Royal Marines, and Royal Air Force. In the British Army Royal Artillery, the title is Bombardier. In the Foot Guards, the title is Lance Sergeant. In the Household Cavalry, the title is Lance Corporal of Horse. In the Royal Navy, the equivalent is Leading Hand. Next in order of seniority is the rank of Sergeant in the British Army and Royal Marines. In the British Army Household Cavalry, the title is Corporal of Horse. In the Royal Navy, the equivalent is Petty Officer. In the Royal Air Force, there are two ranks, Sergeant Aircrew and Sergeant. Above Sergeant is the rank of Staff Sergeant in the British Army. In the Royal Artillery, the title is Colour Sergeant. In the Household Cavalry, the title is Staff Corporal. In the Royal Marines, the rank is Colour Sergeant. In the Royal Navy, the equivalent is Chief Petty Officer. In the Royal Air Force, members hold the rank of Chief Technician, Flight Sergeant Aircrew, or Flight Sergeant. Next in order of seniority is the rank of Warrant Officer Class 2 in the British Army and Royal Marines. A Warrant Officer Class 2 may be appointed as a Squadron, Battery, or Company Quartermaster Sergeant, among other appointments. In the British Army Household Cavalry, the title is Squadron Corporal Major and the appointment is Regimental Quartermaster Corporal. In the Navy, the equivalent is Warrant Officer 2. There is no equivalent rank in the Royal Air Force. Next up are the highest other ranks in the Armed Forces. In the British Army and Royal Marines, the rank is Warrant Officer Class 1. There are several appointments for Warrant Officer Class 1. In the British Army, there are appointments including Regimental Sergeant Major, Conductor, and Army Sergeant Major, with the latter being the most senior Warrant Officer in the Army. In the Foot Guards, the title is Garrison Sergeant Major. In the British Army Household Cavalry, the title is Regimental Corporal Major. In the Royal Marines, the most senior Warrant Officer appointment is Corps Regimental Sergeant Major. In the Royal Navy, the equivalent is Warrant Officer 1. The appointments in the Royal Navy are the Second Sea Lord's Warrant Officer, Fleet Commander's Warrant Officer, and Warrant Officer to the Royal Navy, with the latter being the most senior appointment. In the Royal Air Force, there are two ranks, Master Air Crew and Warrant Officer. Master Aircrew may have titles such as Master Engineer, Master Air Electronics Operator, Master Air Loadmaster, or Master Signaler. 
The most senior warrant officer in the Royal Air Force is appointed as warrant officer of the Royal Air Force. Next up are the ranks for commissioned officers. Commissioned officers in the British Army, Royal Navy, and Royal Air Force start their journey in the armed forces in the training rank of officer cadet. Following completion of basic training, officer cadets in the British Army are commissioned in the rank of second lieutenant. In the Foot Guards, the title is Ensign. In the Blues and Royals, and Royal Hussars, the title is Cornet. In the Royal Marines, the corresponding rank is also second lieutenant, but it is only held during basic training. In the Royal Navy, the equivalent is Midshipman. In the Royal Air Force, the rank is Pilot Officer. Above second lieutenant, in the British Army and Royal Marines, is the rank of Lieutenant. In the Royal Navy, the equivalent is sub-lieutenant. In the Royal Air Force, the rank is flying officer. Next in order of seniority, in the British Army and Royal Marines, is the rank of captain. In the Royal Navy, the equivalent is lieutenant. In the Royal Air Force, the corresponding rank is flight lieutenant. Above Captain, in the British Army and Royal Marines, is the rank of Major. In the Royal Navy, the equivalent is Lieutenant Commander. In the Royal Air Force, the rank is Squadron Leader. Next in order of seniority, in the British Army and Royal Marines, is the rank of Lieutenant Colonel. In the Royal Navy, the equivalent is Commander. In the Royal Air Force, the corresponding rank is Wing Commander. Above Lieutenant Colonel, in the British Army and Royal Marines, is the rank of Colonel. In the Royal Navy, the equivalent is Captain. In the Royal Air Force, the rank is Group Captain. Next in order of seniority, in the British Army and Royal Marines, is the rank of Brigadier. In the Royal Navy, the equivalent is Commodore. In the Royal Air Force, the corresponding rank is Air Commodore. Above the rank of Brigadier, in the British Army and Royal Marines, is the rank of Major General. In the Royal Navy, the equivalent is Rear Admiral. In the Royal Air Force, the rank is Air Vice Marshal. Next in order of seniority, in the British Army and Royal Marines, is the rank of Lieutenant General. In the Royal Navy, the equivalent is Vice Admiral. In the Royal Air Force, the corresponding rank is Air Marshal. Above the rank of Lieutenant General, in the British Army and Royal Marines, is the rank of General. In the Royal Navy, the equivalent is Admiral. In the Royal Air Force, the rank is Air Chief Marshal. Next in order of seniority, are the ranks that are used for ceremonial purposes, in an honorary capacity, or during wartime. In the British Army, the rank is Field Marshal. In the Royal Marines, the rank is Captain General. In the Royal Navy, the equivalent is Admiral of the Fleet. In the Royal Air Force, the rank is Marshal of the Royal Air Force. That's all for the ranks of the British Armed Forces. The Royal Navy is the most senior service, followed by the British Army and the Royal Air Force. In case you are wondering where the Royal Marines fall in the ranking, they are part of the Royal Navy, despite having a different rank structure. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to subscribe and check out our other videos.